We demoed the kitchen all by ourselves, complete with um, crowbars, sledgehammers. We got very down and dirty and completely destroyed the place, but it was very funny because Michael had never done anything like that before. So when he walked in, he had a screwdriver and he was all prepared to unscrew every single screw out of the hinges. I said, no, Michael, the crowbar, <laughs> do this. And then the sledgehammer, do this. And so Michael did that. And once he did it once, it was no problem. My best friend walked in and said, my goodness, you do have your work cut out for you, don't you? <laughs> so, um, but do it. I mean, my word of advice is if you feel you can do it and you're comfortable with it, yeah, absolutely do it. It was a lot more work than I expected. Even just ripping up the carpets, I thought, no problem, rip them up, clean them off. No, there's little staples every maybe <clears throat> 12 to 14 inches. I had to take all of them out in the whole house for a lot of work. And when you walk in, it had a certain feeling that was here from the people that owned it before. And um, we've completely energized it into something brand new and spectacular. The most satisfying thing when I come home is that we all contributed to the overall, we stripped this house down to its bare, bare bones, and then we all contributed to re basically rebuilding the whole vibe and atmosphere, and when I walk in and I feel so happy, oops, sorry, I feel so happy and relieved and just relaxed and anytime I'm in the house and I'm happy I feel like we all contributed to making the house that kind of environment.